Samsung is on a roll and we're paying attention. After the successful M series, Samsung is wooing the budget market with its reimagined A series. We've got both the A30 and the A50 for review, but let's start with the pricier of the two, the A50. When it comes to looks, the A50 wows us with its 6.4-inch Super AMOLED screen which carries forward Samsung's famous Infinity-U display. For a budget-friendly phone, this one looks pretty elegant and even sports a fingerprint sensor which is great at this price point. But it was fairly slow when we tried it. The phone looks pretty good in our hands and the back looks great in daylight. The screen performs well and the colours are vivid in daylight. The Galaxy A50 comes in 4GB and 6GB RAM variants, both with 64GB storage. We would have liked a little more since the cheaper M30 comes with a 128GB option. As far as performance goes, the A50 is powered by the octa-core Samsung Exynos 9610 processor, which leaves no room for complaints and runs without any lag. The phone comes with the latest Android 9 Pie with the new One UI, which we applaud, because we were not too happy with the fact that the M30 packed in the older Android 8.1 update. There is some bloatware which can be annoying like Microsoft Office, LinkedIn and more. But if you look closely, you'll realize that the interface looks slightly different since you get bigger icons. When it comes to juice, the A50 has a decent 4000 mAh battery, 15 watt fast charge technology and USB Type-C for faster data transfers. The battery lasted us easily for a day and a half with heavy use including social media. The budget segment is wowing consumers with gas-worthy camera specs and the A50 also packs in a triple camera on the rear with a 25 megapixel primary camera, an 8 megapixel wide angle and a 5 megapixel depth sensor. We got some vivid images with great edge detection and portrait shots had quite a lot of character. The wide angle lets us fit quite a lot in one frame. There is a 25 megapixel selfie shooter which gives just about average results and we don't like the artificial shots that the beauty mode gives. And now coming to price, the A50's price starts at 19,990 rupees for 4GB RAM. And before we give our verdict, let's dive into our review of the cheaper sibling, the A30. Like the A50, this one too comes with a 6.4-inch Super AMOLED display which has some great colours even in daylight. The glossy sides do mean that this phone will be a fingerprint magnet and there is plastic on the back. There is a fingerprint sensor on this one too and we found it to be quicker than the A50. This A-series phone is powered by the octa-core Samsung Exynos 7904 processor and comes with 4GB of RAM. While this processor isn't the best, it does the job. We tried a few racing games and the phone performed well without any overheating. We're happy to report that this one too runs on Android 9 Pie and the interface is smooth and multitasking is a breeze. Our only gripe with these phones are the annoying ads that pop up from the Galaxy Store. On the optics front, there is a 16MP primary camera and a 5MP wide-angle lens at the back. We like the fact that even at this price point, you get the Scene Optimizer feature within camera section, which is otherwise available in Samsung's super flagship, the S10+. Plus. Images on the A30 are vivid and well-defined. The 16MP selfie camera is just about average and lacks the detailing which we expect in most Samsung phones. Like the A50, the A30 also packs in a 4000mAh battery and it lasted us a day and a half of decent usage. The A30 is also aggressively priced and can be yours for Rs 16,990 for 4GB RAM. And now coming to our verdict. It's evident that with the A-series, Samsung wants to dominate the budget market, previously a territory of Chinese companies like Xiaomi. The A50 is ideal for those looking for triple rear cameras at this price point. The A30 lags a bit behind in specs and we would recommend you go for the A50 with a few thousands more. While you may get better processors and gaming phones in this segment, the new A-series comes with great specs and a solid design backed by the name Samsung.